target of this board was to give it a real easy feel to sail. It's a little wider, a little shorter, very compact, but yet has a great ability of turning. It's not especially a super performance down the line wave board. It's more your really day to day, go out there and have fun board. The boards are a little wider than the, for example, the twin wave or the new wave, yet a bit more compact with slightly different rockers and bottom shapes, even though we keep also our concave bottom design here as we do on the Twinsers and the new waves. We have three sizes, 72, 82 and 92 and these are the shapes that we've been developed for last year's models already. The feedback was fantastic on these boards so we decided to keep them for another year. Also we have been so doing so much development over the years in wave boards that uh, we feel really really good about what we've been doing and what we've been achieving with our computerized software here. We as the team riders um, use the all wave especially in conditions that are not that perfect because the board is really easy to sail, it's really forgiving. Um, if you hit a lip that is not that powerful, the, you, you can always go with the white water and always keep floating. And uh, with other boards, sometimes with more sideshore orientated boards, sometimes you get stuck a bit. With those boards, you always stay on the wave and it's really easy to ride it. Two constructions as well as on the other boards. A team edition with a carbon Kevlar construction, deck and bottom, super light, very strong. That's pretty much very hard to beat in terms of strength and weight ratio. And our custom wood sandwich, a very good um, ratio between price, weight and strength. Um, both of them have a fantastic feel to them and yeah, just check them out.